Hey, this is Toby, and today I want to test the Northeast Way MT5 Expert Advisor from the MT5 Marketplace. It's one of the most popular EAs on the site, and let's see if the price over 10k is fair or if it's just another scam. Okay, so first of all, we need to download the EA, of course, so we can just click on Market here in the Navigator window. So this will bring up all the available expert advisors for MediaTrader 5. And I will sort them just after price down. So here we can see the most expensive EAs um, from the marketplace. And down here, we already see the Northeast Way MT5 Expert Advisor. So I would say it's one of the most popular um, EAs on the marketplace. So if you just click on it, we get more information about the EA. So I already downloaded this EA, but if you want to test it for yourself, here. Um, is a download button and this will install the EA on your local machine here under the expert and market folder. But before you test or of course use a EA, you should always read the provided information from the seller. So here are just some information about the parameters and the markets. And yeah, here are also some screenshots of back tests of this EA. And we also got some reviews, only five star reviews. So Touching from the side here, um, the EA and the strategy is looking very nice. Here are also some live signals we can take a look at. And also here we can see there is some money invested here in the strategy, in this EA. And also the equity and balance curve. Um, it's looking very good and promising. Okay, but now let's see if the EA also um, performs in our back test. Okay, so here we are in the MetaTrader 5 strategy tester. I have already selected the EA we want to test here and all the other settings are based on a video the seller showed on his site. So we will use the New Zealand dollar cat for this back test, the 15 minute time frame, a custom period and the one minute open high, low and close modeling mode. We will start with a 1K account and we will have a leverage of 200. Okay, so and for the inputs, I um, made the inputs based on the video the seller showed on his site. So we will use these three symbols here for the backtest. I use my custom symbols because I know they are they have quality historical data. And all the other inputs are default or like the seller showed or recommended. Okay, so now we can start a visual test uh, just, just to see the EA operating. Um, okay, we can see we get a nice looking panel here. Let's just pause for a second. We can see we get a nice looking panel here and a lot of indicators. They are all like standard deviation indicators and on the chart there are also a few moving averages, I would say. So let's just see a few trades. Maybe we should um, pull this down here. Oh no, I have to start from the bottom all the way up to see the actual chart. I will fast forward this. Finally, okay. So now we can see the actual chart. So we see we have a panel here and let's just press play again. We have like 10 moving averages, I think. Yeah, let's just wait for the first trades. Okay, so right here we have our first trade um, was a buy trade here, a profitable buy trade. So let's just wait for some more trades. So we can see the open positions uh, down here and we can see a lot of times the EA opens multiple positions per symbol. Uh, so I think this EA is based on some kind of Martin Gale or grid system. Um, yeah, but now we can basically stop the visual test and we can take a look at the back test for the whole period of 10 years or more. So we just close this window here 
Okay, so now we can just uncheck here this visual mode and we can start the test with our inputs for the last 10 years or more. So this will also take a while. I will speed this up, but you can take a look here at the equity graph and you can see the performance of the expert advisor. So here at the start, we can already see the balance is going up. That's very nice, but we can see these spikes here in the equity also here. So this is a very high risk um, that we maybe blow the whole account. But let's see how this will turn out. Okay, so are we done testing? No, we stopped in 2015 and it looks like we have a huge uh, drawdown here. So let's take a look at the journal. First of all, let's turn this off. Okay, so if we take a look here at the journal, um, we can see the tester stopped uh, nearly halfway. Uh, if we scroll up a little bit, we have a lot of error messages here. Not enough money to buy uh, some more lots. So we run into a big drawdown and now we don't have the money to recover. So basically it's a Martingale system and our account is basically dead. So that's also the problem with these systems. So I mean, the equity looks very nice, right? Um, of course, up until here at this point where we blow the whole account, but you have a lot of winning trades, but there will be one situation where yeah, the A will just blow the whole account and you will lose all the money you have earned here. Of course, if you stop the EA here at some point, you will you will have made a lot of money. That's I, I cannot deny this, but um, the risk to blow your whole account is always present. So maybe we we take a more, more conservative uh, risk um, approach here. So we can enter, let's say, five thousand here for this auto management money management, I don't know. And let's do this test again. Maybe we will survive this one uh, big drawdown. So again, sick light show, uh, have fun. Okay, so it looks like uh, this time we survived. Here this big drawdown and also this one. So let's see how this turns out. Okay, so the back test is done. Um, I have to say the equity looks quite nice. But if you are trading such an EA, it's basically a grid or yeah, a martingale system. You have to be aware that your whole account is at risk at any time. So it can be over from one day to another. As we saw in our first backtest, there can be in the future a big drawdown and we don't have enough money to open another position. And then basically the whole account is, is gone. And if we take a look at the MT4 version here of this EA and we go to comments and scroll down, we can see a screenshot of a blown account from the seller. So these situations do happen where, it, where you just lose all the money in your account. And also these 3 million US dollar here invested in the strategy at this time, basically gone. If you take a look at the signal now here, multi-way, um, we go back to overview multi-way MT5, the signal is no longer active. So of course you only see what the seller wants you to see. 
So I would like the seller to just um, mention the potential risk that comes with using this EA on a live account. And in the end, it's up to you if you want to use such a EA based on a grid or martingale system or not. Um, for me, I personally, I would never use uh, such an EA on my live account. So after all, I just want to say, I think it's better to develop your own EAs and systems. Um, if you really want to trade a EA from someone else, always test it before you let it run on your live account. How to develop your own um, trading systems. I have already made videos about this here in this playlist. I will link it up here. And if you want to start to code your own EA in MQL5 for MetaTrader 5, we also did some videos here on our channel about a moving average crossover and also a time range breakout EA. I will also link it up here. Okay, so I will see you in one of the next videos. Um, be careful and good trades. Bye.